Zoe, you kind of got the whole science fiction I do. thing down. Star Trek, Avatar are coming up, and of course now Galaxy. I promise you it's not on purpose. I, I, I you know, I don't, I don't know. I think maybe unconsciously I've been running away from ever being boxed in that I, I chose my own box, you know what I mean? I love science fiction. I love working and talking and relating to people that are able to imagine the unimaginable. Space is something that most of us will never ever get to experience firsthand. And yet, there's so many creative artists and filmmakers that give us the uptake of space and, and then they, they, add, they add drama, they add characters that are unforgettable and adventures that are so inspiring. But I'm like, why not? Why not just be out here? <laughs> and what's nice is you know kind of where you're going to be over the next few years. You've got all these other projects lined up, including Avatar through what, 2022 or something? Yes, yes. I mean, I do, I do, I do take breaks whenever I, I'm able to in between these space movies to do, to play Earthlings. You know, I did Live by Night that was directed by, by Ben Affleck and I enjoyed it so much. And it was so good to go back to the past, you know, versus like always looking into the future.